ever since I've been here, that's been the goal is, to, you know, being a top four of CAA, obviously the higher the better, but uh, definitely, you know, been wanting to get that by and, you know, it's, it's great that we got it this year so far. It means a lot playing against, like, top teams, you know, it shows, like, you know, recruits that I can play with, the, you know, some of the big players like Deladon and all that stuff. In Delaware was a game where my, my players were close to playing their best, especially here, you know, that you had everybody really having a good game. You know, Shantae, um, Shantae kind of struggled a little bit in that game. You know, Candace Blocky had 21 points, Caitlin Loper, you know, and then and then we, um, you know, of course, Del Dons had her career high on us both, 41 one time, 42 the next time. We need to do a better job of how we're going to try to contain her, you know, and, and changing up our defense a little bit more next time we play them. I mean, there's no argument with that. You know, we had those two losses, and then we turned it around and beat Mason at Mason, and then we had Delaware that Thursday. Um, and, you know, and, and then we turned around the following Thursday and played JMU, so we knew we had to, you know, had tough, tough games down the stretch. Good thing about conference is that we have, you know, top teams like Delaware and JMU. You get to see them, like, twice throughout the whole year. So going to the conference play would be a third time playing them, I and it's hard to put, be a person, you know, be a team three, three times in a row. So it definitely helps us. I mean, we watch film, we go back and see what we went wrong, and we pick, um, put that in play for when we play them. We've beaten two teams that are ranked in the top 15, and our RPI is close to 50 right now. Um, those wins are what keeping us viable candidate for the NCAA still, depending on how well we do. She's been consistent throughout the whole year with practice, uh, you know, towards the end of the year. I mean, maybe less time in practice since, you know, keep our bodies, keep our legs going, because, you know, 30 games in a season, you know, your body's trying to starts to wear down. The beginning of the year practices is obviously a lot of defense, a lot of fundamentals, barely touching basketball is just like a lot of, you know, fundamental stuff that she needs to ingrain in our freshmen and, you know, lay the foundation for. And there are a lot longer practices in the beginning of the year. Once we get into, you know, conference and, and December and January sessions, you know, it's a lot less um, time on the court, but a lot more executed and a lot more situational. Our program never went to the NCAA yet. Um, our program has never won the CEA uh, title yet. Doing well in, a, in the tournament and making it to the NCAAs will definitely bring us over the top. And I mean, it would be great for Hofstra to be getting big time recruits and it'll definitely take this program to the next level. You know, it's, it's where we are striving to go. It's, it's where, personally, as a coach, what I've kind of committed to Candace Bellocchio and Nicole Caparso and Marie Malone about, you know, we have the quality team, quality program, quality university. Um, and we want to be, you know, contending with the big BCS schools. We want to be playing at that level.